What's up everybody? Seth with VaporBeast.com. Today we are going to talk about the Aspire ESP30. So Aspire first made its big footprint last year with the Nautilus tank. Um, and as most of you remember, that was the, the very first nice size tank with adjustable airflow on the outside. And it pretty much revolutionized what we all knew about tanks and vaping. Um, shortly after that, they released the Atlantis, which opened the floodgates for all the new sub tanks that we're getting now. Um, Aspire really is known for innovation and they're known for their quality. So they're one of the top brands in the United States. Um, so I guess first we'll start with talking a little bit about the features of the box itself. All right, so now we'll talk about our features. Um, the ESP 30 watt boasts a 1900 milliamp battery. Uh, that should give you some nice long vaping time. Uh, they chose to put a potentiometer on the top instead of putting the clicky buttons probably because they felt like this would be a little more durable. And I'll tell you what, to me, it feels like a nice sturdy device. It's very light, surprisingly, but uh, it feels like it would be really hard to break. Um, it fires down to 0.3. You got a nice wattage spectrum from uh, five watts to 30 watts for all you uh, 20 watt vapors. And of course, like I said, it passes through. So they chose to put the pass through here on the bottom instead of on the side. Uh, I like it on the bottom because personally when I'm vaping, the side can kind of get in my way and irritate me. So for me, bottom's the way to go. So uh, I think that pretty much uh, finishes us up for its features. And next we will talk about what you will receive. All right, so what's in the box? Um, this is the box you will receive with your Aspire ESP30, and I promise you there will definitely be an ESP30 in this box, but also you will receive here uh, a USB, uh, micro USB charger, and I'll tell you the truth, to me this one looks a lot more high, high quality than some of the other USBs I've received with some of my other devices, so um, all in all I think Aspire is really trying to take care of us here. So. Um, up next, I will tell you why I think this box is beast. All right, so the Aspire ESP 30 watt box is beastly because it's small, it's lightweight, it's powerful, and it's affordable. I think it's suitable for any vapor out there, regardless of where you are in your vaping spectrum. So thanks for tuning in, guys. This is Seth with Vapor Beast telling you to. Keep the beast.